today I'm gonna show you guys my jelly slime recipe. Okay, so this is pretty much all you're gonna need. I'm gonna use two gallons and about this much of instant snow powder. It's a powder that when you add water, it, it absorbs the water and it grows, it expands. So it's pretty much the stuff you find in diapers. This stuff is also used to throw like snow parties in places where there's not a lot of snow, like for example, California. And for slime, it's the secret recipe to make jelly slime. The next step I do is I add the instant snow so now what I do, I just turn on the mixer until all the white specks are fully gone. So this is how it looks after five minutes. It's still clumpy as you can tell. So we're still gonna keep on mixing. It's been about 10 to 15 minutes and this is how the slime looks after a while, after 10 minutes. The instant snow has absorbed the glue. So now it's time to go in with activator. And if you guys are wondering, the activator I'm using is the borax method. If you're making a small amount, you don't really need this much activator. I use this big one because I obviously make a lot of slime. And to make a small amount of activator, you're gonna use one teaspoon of borax powder to one cup of hot water and then you stir it and mix it until it's fully dissolved. But it has to be completely dissolved, it can't be chunky and stuff. So when you're done with it, the slime's gonna look obviously very foggy. So this is what a little piece looks like. So now we close it up and we wait. It is the next day. This is how the slime looks after a day. It has a lot of air bubbles on top because all the air bubbles are rising from within the slime. Let's see how the bottom looks. Ooh, okay. Grab the very bottom of it. So this is how the very bottom of the batch looks. It's already starting to clear up and it looks jellyish. I don't know if you guys could tell. You guys see that? All this part is still like air bubbles rising, but this part right here, the edges, it's already clearing up. And that's after one day. So we're gonna put this right back and we'll be back in a couple of days. All right, you guys, so here is the jelly slime and this is the final result. Whoa. Wow. So that's it guys, that's how you make a jelly slime. This one came out so good. I will also insert clips of it being scented and colored after. Try it out, tell me how it turns out, and tag me at Squishy Bunny.
and that's how I make my jelly slimes. I made a bunch of different ones, all scented, and they all came out great. I will be taking all these jelly slimes with me to Slime Mania. Slime Mania is this Sunday, August 11th, in Atlanta. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video, and also comment down below which was your favorite jelly slime that I made. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.